What's up, YouTube world? Hope everyone's well. So, it's a beautiful day out. Today's Wednesday, August 15th. Just want to make a vlog here. Um, yeah, you know, I know. It's like that channel. I, like, I'm always going to make these videos just for the sake of when I put them out there on YouTube, they're just going to stay there. And I know over time, some people, somebody, whether it's male, female, whoever, may stumble across it and just be like, oh, wow, this guy said some good advice, or this or that, you know. And I could have uploaded that years ago, though. But, hey, you know, I, I kind of think of, even if nobody watches this now, doesn't mean that later on in the future, it might be kind of useful when it's not right now, but again, that's just my opinion. Just, uh, just wanted to say, hey, just a new day today. Have faith up there. Now you don't have to believe in that. You don't have to believe in God or anything, maybe the cosmos, but have faith in something, a greater power than yourself. Be like, all right, whatever's going on, that's going on, but continue to move forward. All right, my little word, advice piece today. I could technically make this a short. I think what are shorts? Like they're the videos more of the, at least when you're looking at it, at it through the, you know, with the phone. And it's like, oh, okay, so it's like that. And yeah, but... I'm not gonna do that. I guess I'll just make it'll just be more like just a regular video. Yeah, but yeah, just uh, continue moving forward. What am I gonna do today? Well, I'm gonna be out. That's for sure. You know, uh, exercise and stuff. And um, my coffee Ooh. with uh, minimal cream. By the way, you like this mug, NASA? Yeah. My uh, oldest sister gave me this mug several years back. You know, it's just like a little present, and you know, uh, I like it. You know, I'm not really a big uh, into like space or stuff like that, but I do like it a lot. And anytime I get a gift, it is going to be well used for sure. Though, especially a gift that I like. Oh. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, I can't be spilling coffee. <laughs> it was just a little bit, but, but yeah. Well, mm. <sighs> just wanted to also share something, so not that I need it, because if you just look at me, thin, skinny, lean, but I've been uh, more go going toward um, fasting or eating a little less though as to go you know just trying to eat a lot or maintain a certain weight but OMAD you've heard of OMAD before one meal a day generally it's like you would have that meal toward the evening time dinner time it could be five six o'clock seven eight or or whenever the sun goes down whenever the sun sets so I know here in Atlanta now that we're in spring, the sun generally starts to go down around this time, you know, early April, close to 8 o'clock. I think sunset yesterday was at 8. And I remember in the last few days, I started intermediate fasting. So basically, you have coffee. I, I've i always heard the general rule of fasting, especially when you have the lip, when you're consuming the liquids so uh so is anything that raises your insulin is going to break your fast no that would be a certain amount of calories or you know with sugars and stuff like that yeah that that will raise your insulin though i'm not a doctor and stuff or anything so i kind of say like, okay black coffee good can coffee with cream Non, I'm having non-dairy cream though. It's the powder kind. is very little. 
I still feel like I'm like, okay, that's not, that's not going to break the fast. Green tea, water, then you could also have water with lemon or lime. Also have uh, water with like sea salt. No, because also you start to lose, like your body is going to start losing salt at potassium. You need, uh, no, or sodium, but also potassium as well though, which you could also get with your, when you're pouring lemon though. I do that, so doing though drinking those liquids, not a, not too much, because you can't drink too much. Though next thing you know, your kidneys are working overtime, and that's that's not that's not good. That's not good. You can't be drinking too much, and your body knows. Always fairly listen to body. Now, yeah, the hunger cravings will happen. Now I, I noticed even after the first day, I was like, I I can handle the, I can control the hunger. I was feeling a little tired though. I was probably also due to the fact that when I had to work and do the fast, I only had coffee and then basically water throughout the day. I didn't have, I think I started noticing that my electrolytes were like, okay, wait a minute. Because I'm doing this and, you know, I'm not really experiment. I haven't had much experience with this that much. So it's like, okay. The effects I'm starting to see, but I'm carefully monitoring myself, knowing that I'm like, okay, I gotta do a little better, and I, this is what I gotta do, you know, with the mistakes I made. Though there will be some mistakes, that's for sure. Though, but as long as I know I'm getting the benefits of that and feeling good, we're all good, right? You know, why am I doing this? Uh, I got my reason, my reasons, but the main reason is just discipline. So, discipline, pretty much from head to toe. I, I feel like we could have, you know, just we all need a reset once in a while. Like, think of our our body is like a computer. You know, we all need to have certain a reset though, and fasting. You know, when done correctly, it's probably one of the most powerful, if not the most powerful tool you could you have access to. I mean, basically to better yourself, to improve your health. When you improve your health internally, it's just going to push. It's going to be pressing outward. Now, can I go prolonged fast, 24, 36? I haven't done that, though. I don't see really a reason for me to do that right now. So, will I at least try a 24 hour fast one day? Yes, that's for sure though. But I like to be active, I like to be out and about, so it's like kind of no point. So I'm sticking with the intermediate fasting where like, let's say when I have dinner at night, and say whatever, yeah, I'm done eating my last meal, and if anything that I last put in my mouth, whether it's food or a drink, it will be at night. Um, it could be eight, nine, or even ten o'clock. From then on, I don't eat. And then when I wake up, the so-called breakfast, because that's where the term "you break your fast" breakfast. Can, it comes from though. I don't have anything, no food. Try to make sure the coffee, whatever I put in the coffee, doesn't spike my insulin to break the fast. Continue, continue. I try to keep myself of a not eating for roughly, if I can at least, let's see. Say like 16 to 18 hours though, give or take. I mean, everybody fasts. When you're sleeping, you're not eating, you're fasting because you're not eating for extended period of time. Then continue that while you're awake. You still see, you, you notice the, as, as you notice as you're prolonging it and then the benefits start coming. You go, you go. Yeah, but I would say about a certain, at that certain time, and then you eat, and like, oh, okay. 
But yeah. I know, I sound like I'm not know what I'm saying, but I'm I'm just saying this is just from my experience and how I'm feeling though. I'm not I'm not like I don't feel weak. My muscles are not like aching or or cramping up or anything like that. I don't I don't feel like I'm all sickly and stuff. It's just I'm feeling good. I'm gonna do it. I'm feeling good. I'm looking good. And I mean, it's just I think people just need to do this more, more often. It's my opinion. <laughs> Anyways, was well, that a butterfly? Also, every now and then, certain things that you see omens. I also look for signs though, whether what the universe is saying, what the cosmos are saying, what God's saying. You know, if you're more spiritual on that, I, I am though. So I don't. That's just my belief though, because we are getting signs from the universe, whether it's God or whoever. There are signs out there, and I think we just got to be more aware of that and pay attention. Always got to pay attention to that. So, but I think today's it's going to be a good day. I mean, it's almost ten o'clock, so. I'm almost done with my black coffee, well, semi-black coffee, so like one small tablespoon of non, of non-dairy powdered creamer mixed with coffee, two cups of coffee, and then basically throughout the day, I'm going to make sure that like when I'm drink, when I drink water, you know, I'm drinking enough water, I'd like to have like some have some salt, you know, so I'm not really like losing my my electrolytes are not off, so like you know, sodium, potassium, all that stuff. Drink it throughout the day, seeing how I feel, and then when it's nighttime, or at least when the sun goes down or close to it, I'll have my meal, and ah, uh, yeah, uncut, un uncut, raw, real. This is me, yeah, and yeah, I, I just, I think I, I've said this before in other videos that I just want whoever watches these videos, at least in the future, to think this guy wasn't a fake or a phony, he's just, he just keep he just keeps it real, just keeping it real, alright, got much love for y'all, and I'm out, go, go out there and enjoy your day. Even if you're working or school, well, at least school, the school here is on spring break, though. But if you're in college or something, just, just whatever you're doing, enjoy it. All right, because we need to. We need to. All right, peace.